Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon You Some. That's my new favorite word for it. Uh, I'd like to apologize first off uh, for multiple things. So I think I, I prefaced this in the last episode, but I've been crazy sick. Like, my stomach has been bothering me like crazy. And migraines out the wazoo, just mainly because of the stomach pains. But yeah, it's it's not been pretty for me. And I'm going to be missing a couple days, and I apologize for that. Uh, I'm going to be missing another day on my main channel and all that kind of fun stuff. In other news, I messed up last episode. Um, I got tweets telling me that part of it was cut off at the end, and I apologize. I didn't get to finish the entire thing. Sometimes Adobe Premiere does that if it doesn't have enough space. And when I was done rendering it, I looked at it, and it was like, it was 41 minutes. And I was like, oh, okay, it was rendered out fine. Little did I realize it was supposed to be like 44 minutes, so that was my bad, I apologize for that. All you really missed was, uh, me capturing the little cutie patootie. Toblerone! <laughs> I don't think you guys caught- I- I actually didn't see where it got cut off. Up, attack, lowered speed- ah, that's not bad at all! I haven't looked at, like, the natures of any of my Pokemon. But we caught Toblerone here, don't ask why I named him Toblerone, or her Toblerone. I don't know why, but after I caught her, I just kept thinking about Toblerones, and I was like, I want to name her that. So, I think it's a really cute name. Then we got Grabina, the up attack minus special attack. Wow, you are not going to be staying on my team for very long. I'm sorry, Grabina. And, of course, the, uh, yeah, we already saw this one. Uh, minus special attack isn't too bad. It's not. I guess that might be beneficial. I don't know. I haven't seen, like, Decidueye's full move pool, but we're getting out of here. We're going to go talk to Lily. It feels like it's been a while. <laughs> I forgot that they, they're fighting with Rock Ruff in there. Um, but in other news, I'm going to tomorrow, which this is probably going to be uploaded on. I'm going to San Jose for Pokemon Regionals. So hopefully I'll be able to get at least one more video out this weekend. I apologize if I can't. I, I feel like I'm just apologizing too much. And I don't like giving myself excuses. I also have Sprite here, which I normally don't drink. I, I never drink pop. But my stomach has been bothering me so much that I went for a walk with Link and picked up some Sprite. I think it's Sprite. I think I said 7-Up. I'm pretty sure it's Sprite. I don't know if there's a difference. I really don't. I feel like they're the same thing. Huh. I, I totally spaced out and forgot that they were talking there. But yeah, that that's where I'm at in life right now. My teeth are bothering me. Like, when you lick them, they feel, like, all, like, dirty and stuff like that. Even though I just brushed my teeth, like, an hour ago. Because I don't drink pop and it feels like it's bothering my teeth and I don't like it. Gotta get it clean now! And she's talking, they're basically practicing moves in there. Yada yada yada, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> the patience of a gnat. Some of you may appreciate that, that I have no patience. And that I, I, I just can't be bothered to listen to that. Because I'm sure a lot of you are just like me. Massive ADHD and don't care. Oh my god, look at the... Look at the little love disc in the back. Oh, there's a Corsola in there, too. Hey there, h -Pop. Thanks for getting him for me, Lily. Look at Rock Ruff. It's a little Link. Of course. However. Oh, wow. However, I can be a help. I was supposed to be your assistant, right? Rock Ruff's moves were just so styling. And I was making progress. Say, so, let me see your Pokemon. Oh, is this where we get to see the Rotom Dex? I'm actually excited to see if the Rotom Dex plays a bigger part in this game. I've heard it does. Or at least the capture mode is a lot cooler, or something weird like that. I think. I don't know, I could be entirely wrong. See, there's this Pokemon inside your Pokedex. It's called a Rotom. Rotom? Yeah. It's, uh, it's a guy named Tom who likes to row a lot. No, it's a Pokemon, you moron. It's a peculiar Pokemon made of electricity. It likes to go to machines. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. And to put it in the crazy skills of uh, communication and the beauties and the Pokemon, he's got arms. It's goes... a noisy mix. I wish you could battle with Rotom Dex. I don't think you can in this game. I know for a fact in Sun and Moon you couldn't. I think that'd just kind of be cool. Like, it doesn't have to be strong. Like, give him a cool Z move or something that's kind of unique. You know what I'm saying? You know, wouldn't that be cool? I totally spaced out. Apparently the, the Rotom's going into my decks right now. I, I thought he was already in there. He's so cool. Oh, Rock Ruff. Does Rock Ruff want to come with me? Wait. Oh, I was not reading. I, I did not know. I was trying to move around and I had no idea Rotom was talking on the bottom screen. Check it out, Bob. Now your Rotom can talk to you. It doesn't shut up. 
Weird, weirdly, by him going into a machine, he learns English. Huh. The more you know. Thank you very much. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> uh huh, uh huh. Who just walked in? Oh, it's how Lame. I thought it was gonna be, for some reason, like in my mind, I was like, oh, it's the Rainbow Rocket Squad or whatever they're called. I kind of got excited. I was like, oh boy, actual. Stop it. Actual, like, uh, filler talk that I care about. What, what? What, what is happening here? Like, is this really relevant? Can you guys shut up? Like, th this still bothers me so much about Pokemon. They talk so much. They do so much talking in these games. Alright, get a move on? Yes! Yes! Please! Yes! Okay, we're supposed to go to the trainer school now. I understand that. Now, no, shut up. I don't care about how. Like, I kind of wish... I feel like Zelda was perfect. I, I I hope that when the Pokemon comes out for the Switch, it's just like an open world thing. <laughs> like, they did a kind... They kind of did open world... Not really. Open world with uh, Super Mario Odyssey or Mario Odyssey. And they did such a good job with those two games. I can't wait for the Pokemon to go to the Switch. I think it's going to be amazing. I don't think it's just going to be like a normal, like another Sun and Moon or something like that. I think it's going to be something really special. And I want them to go... There's a Slowpoke out there. Slow. I love Slowpoke. Is there anything over here? I was really hoping there was... I was banking on there being something over here. You guys are like trying to team up on Rockruff. I don't think there's anything downstairs. I'm just hoping to find an item or something. This is where... Just a random poly or Goosh? I'll <laughs> goosh. Oh, goosh. So this is must be where you uh, can change the form of Rotom, I'm guessing. I don't know if you could capture a Rotom in Sun and Moon. I feel like I missed out a lot on some... I, I, have, I don't know if I missed out on anything. I just feel like I haven't played in a while. Like, I don't remember ever seeing a Rotom that I could capture, other than, like, you know, the normal Rotom decks. I don't really capture him. Oh, great, more talking. Okay, something's happening. Everything has fallen into darkness. Okay, alright, this is, this is dialogue I appreciate. New stuff, is this gonna be Necrozma? Pew. Nebby, don't worry, it's okay. That must be what they call a solar eclipse. It happens when the sun gets covered up. Was a solar eclipse for it? No, you wouldn't know if there was a solar eclipse in the forecast. An omen? You think something good will happen? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Sure, a <laughs> long time. Face that all the darkness, they have the light. Gathering Z crystals and turn them into island challenges. I'm assuming that had something to do with Necrozma coming down to the world or something like that. Apparently, in the box art, I don't know where mine is. Uh, Lunala and Solgaleo, that's not them. That's Necrozma, like, morphed into them or something like that. It's not... I always thought that it was, like, Necrozma taking control of Solgaleo or Lunala, but apparently it's not, which I don't know how I feel about that. A little indifferent. A little indifferent. <laughs> I don't think I have, like, a really, like, oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm, I'm really glad that it's Necrozma and not Lunala, actually. Oh great, more Wingles. I remember we ended the last episode off and all I could find is Wingles and the occasional Inke. The most annoying, stupid Pokemon in the game. Wingle. No, Dunsparce is. Uh, Dunsparce. But Wingle's just super annoying. Wingle seems to be like so popular. Like it, it pops, not, not as in people like it, but as in uh, it just pops up way too often and I hate it. Don't run into a trainer, please. Great. I should probably start training up Inke. Give me a cool Pokemon. What could pop in up here? Okay, so I could have been in this grass too, it looks like. Are you gonna be a high level? I don't want you. If I saw another Grubbin, I'd consider capturing him because, like I said, there's... I, I, I'm not too excited. Like, I love Grubbin, but in a Let's Play, it's so slow and it'll bother me on how slow it is. You know what I'm saying? Oh, oh, stop it. It would just be like so annoying, like just everything outspeeding me and I'd have to keep running back to the Pokemon Center. That's why I really like fast Pokemon or just like average speed Pokemon. I'm fine with average speed. I just don't want slow Pokemon. I I, I would make an exception for Slowpoke, but I've used Slowpoke in multiple 
Oh, let's play, so I'll pass on that. I do love me a slowpoke, a good old slow bro slow king. My eye is bothering me now. This one, right here. I take out the- shut up! Over there's the cafe area. I actually want to see if you re say anything new about that. Each of the- a different selection of drinks. I wonder what they pick and serve. The cafe's- Okay. They give a special treat still. I think that's all she really said. I was wondering if she was going to go more in depth with it. Because I kind of would just go buy a drink and then it would, he would randomly give me something. And I never quite understood, like, what are the odds of him giving me something else? Or even if there are odds, or if it's like a set thing each time. I think I should start training up Inke, though. Inke is super good. Contrary Inke. I'm so excited to use you. <laughs> I am really excited to use you. Boom. I wanted Grabina to go into that, because I'm not going to use Grabina anymore. <laughs> I've decided against Grabina. There'll probably be, like, a future episode where I'm like, I want to use Grabina. I'm going to use Grabina. Lemonade, I guess. I, I, 198, sure. Give me something cool. Good, just give me a minute. Here, take a Master Ball. Oh my god, my eye is really starting to bother me. One Lemonade, just for you. Wow, you did not make it yourself. You just, you grab literally a little soda can. Like a 7-Up or Sprite. Which is the difference. You're limited to one per day, but have a tea biscuit. An old Gato. Okay, an old Gato is pretty much like a full heal. And those normally go for $600 if I'm pretty sure, so that that's nice. That's nice. And we got some poke beans. Oh, I forgot about the... Oh. I don't remember what it was called, but there was like a... The old like a circular castle thing where you could trade Pokemon. I do not remember the name of it. Oh my god. Why do we have 35k? We'll buy 10 Pokeballs. Give me the... Premier Ball, yep. Okay, they still do have that in here. That's nice. I'll grab 10 potions, because, you know, why not? Were potions 200? I feel like they were in Sun and Moon. Normally, they used to be 300. I will buy an escape rope. Just one. Because that helps out with LPs a lot. And we'll buy some ripples. We'll buy five of them. We'll be a little cautious with our money. I will buy uh, Antidote. A few of those. Thank you. And I will buy a couple of Paralyzed Heals. I do have one, so I don't need to buy too many. I'm very crazy. I should probably buy an Awakening, but I'm just going to pass. We have Old Gato. And how how common are we going to be put to sleep? Fast forward five minutes from now when I run into a nice little Ghastly that uses Hypnosis and can't miss it ever. Is Tauros here? Please be a Bouffalant. Don't just be another Tauros. Be a Bouffalant. Make a difference. It's a Tauros. Okay. I like subtle changes, and like I said, like with the last episode, I was talking about like how I wish Meowth was an Alola Meowth, but it didn't make sense, so I kind of took it back. Like if that was a Buffalo, I'd be like, oh, it's a Buffalo, awesome, but it's just a Tauros again. It's just a Tauros. It's nothing special. And what do you think we'll find at the Bullet Trainer's School place? Find your mom. I want you guys to do like a oh or something like that. Hey there, H bomb. You must have passed you somehow. Yeah, cause. Apparently, uh, I got caught up with Lily for five minutes in the Pokemon Center because she thinks I'm an idiot. Four! Actually, it's like four. Four. You've got to be four. 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 Really like cool. Oh, we got experience share! I forgot we get that early in this game. And that's like the one that like, it's just, it goes on and then it goes to all of my Pokemans. So that'll help with training Inke, I think. I'll probably end up still trying to use them a little bit. Um, I'm not listening. Not one bit was I listening to that. Are they going to be in the same exact place? Yep. They're going to be in the same exact place, too. Wait, there was a secret over here. Hold on. I remember this. Maybe not. I seriously thought there was a secret over here. Maybe it's over here? Hello? Stuff? Maybe it's back here? I remember there was an item. I don't remember where. Are you, are you an item back here? Item. Nope. Great. Okay. That's just battle. I look dumb. I look dumb. My precious Bonsly will kick your butt. Also, it is Bonsly. It's not Bonsly. I wish it was Bonsly, because that just sounds a lot better. But in the anime, I remember Brock having a Bonsly, and I feel like a Mime Jr. I feel like that. I'm not sure. But I remember it always being called Bonsly. And it bo bothered me quite a bit. It's just like, why not be Bonsley? It's a cooler name. Do you have a superpower yet? 
How sick would that be if Toblerone already had superpower? But we have a uh, Robin Hood here who will take care of a rock type in a second. Although it hits for. No, it doesn't hit for super effective damage. It hits for, hits for neutral. Fake tears. Is that attack or is that special attack? Special defense. Okay. Wow, that's not the move for you, Bonsly. We're gonna leafage. Will this one shot? No. Wow, I expected it to do like three fourths. Not that much. I, no, I mean, I'm expected to do a little bit more, not that little. I guess Robin Hoot just isn't as strong as he should be. Or maybe Bonsly is just bulky. I know it's bulky on the defensive side, but I didn't know special. No, oh, wait, that is a defensive attack. Never mind. I, I My brain's not there. Like I said, I haven't been feeling good. I've been lying down all day because I needed to. I get dizzy whenever I get up. I'm surprised I'm even. I've been recording for like 15 minutes now and I haven't passed out yet. This is awesome. The rest of your team gains experience too. Grabina, I'm sorry you didn't gain a level. I'm sorry, Grabina. Maybe if I could change your nature somehow, we'll talk about using you again. What did she just say? I have no idea. She was making no sense whatsoever. Ooh. You know, let's before we go and take on more trainers, like a good Pokemon trainer, I am gonna go over here because I know there's grass, because nothing's changed in this game apparently. <laughs> such a negative way to look at it. It has changed quite a bit. Um, but hopefully there's some cool Pokemon over here. I mean, so far, I heard a Pokemon that I don't recognize. But I remember in the old Sun and Moon game... Oh, hey, I think we're supposed to battle you. There was Alone Meowth, there was Alone Gr Grimer, and there was Magnemites. I was actually thinking... All right then. Did not expect that. Um, scared me a little bit. Confused the hell out of me. Oh, uh, that was kind of cool though. Okay. All right, Rotom Dex, you're going up in my book so far. You at least did something cool. Unlike this uh, Magnemite trying to supersonic me. I I I switched out of Inke because Inke is level five and this Magnemite is level seven. And I'm gonna run now. I thought Leafage would do a little bit more than that. I was hoping to be at least a three hit KO, but no. No, not even close. All right, let's put Robin Hood up front. Um, if we do knock out a Pokemon, Inke will still get Toblerone, sorry. We'll still get XP, so it's not that big of a deal if he doesn't get the full thing or she. God, we have, we have the female squad in this team, other than Robin Hood. Robin Hood's all about the females. <laughs> Just like Robin Hood, apparently. Um, <laughs> we'll, we'll run into a few more Pokemon and see if there's anything cool around here. Not interested in a little meow. I've never seen this Pokemon. Kind of cool. I, I hope he says some different stuff too, not just that over and over again. Level eight. Run. Are we serious? Can you back off? Uh, knock him out. That's not even a stab scratch. That's a stab bite. This is going to do a lot. He's still going to need at least two more hits to knock me out. Okay. We're going to need a potion after this one. Yeah, use Growl. That's fine with me. That's completely fine with me. Just keep using Growl. Uh, it would be best if we just got a critical hit right here. No. Wow, this might be at least two more hits. Okay. I was hoping a potion would fully heal him up after this, but it's not. Please, Growl. No. You jerk. Okay, at least this is decent XP. Um, What's his name? Tob or what's her name? Toblerone will gain a level from this, I believe, because it was close to level 6. Yeah, there we go. Toblerone grew level 6. Didn't learn any move yet. I haven't looked at Inke's uh, level up move set. I probably should. We'll do, we'll do two more encounters and see if there's anything cool in here. I really don't know what's in here. I, I, we're gonna, we're, okay, stop it, Meowth. Why do I have to run into Meowth? If I run into a Magnemite, I could run away from it easily. Watch it be level nine. Eight, please run. I didn't heal. 
We're trying to run one more time. Yeah. Second time's the charm. I will do one more and then I will battle this dude and I'm gonna look up what I could capture in here. Cause I am curious. Potion, use this item on Robin Hood. Thank you. Um, because I am curious. I do want to get a cool team. I don't want just like another average team. That's all I'm kind of excited for Inke. I don't know if other YouTubers are gonna be using Inke, but I love Inke. And then cool. Oh my god. Uh Pokemon. This wire is like right on my own. It makes it impossible. Use some uh, trainer school to school for cool. Ha! Uh, that's funny. That's a joke I made many a times when I was younger. Okay. You can get me out, Zoroa. Zoro was kind of awesome. Did I just run into a Zoro? All the little Meowths were level 8 until that one. Wow, that's the rare encounter. Wow, an Alolan Grimer! Whoa, it's ugly! It really is ugly. So should I be like hitting every... I don't know if Zoro will just pop up as Zoro. Or, let's try it. Let's just use Peck really quick. I don't know if it'll pop up as Zoro or if it'll pop out as a different Pokemon and then you have to hit him. Okay, no, this is a Grimer. I don't want a Grimer. Go away. I, I, I'm so down for a Zoro. Little uh, Zorua there, and a little Zoroarga there. <laughs> I went to Target with Shelby the other day and I ended up buying that. Yeah, I needed it. I only have two Zoroark GXs, so I need a third. I need a fourth now. I do need a play set of them. All right, let's see. If you're a level eight, I will run. If you're level seven, I'll hit you. Level seven, I did not heal again. Uh, leafage. Zoro's not gonna. Oh uh, no, Zoro could have. Growl, I guess. I'm looking up its moveset. No, I wouldn't have Growl. This isn't a Zoro. I just took poison damage for no reason. Can I. Sh nope. Oh, stop it. Stop. You're level 7. This poison is doing more damage than you are. Alright. Alright. I, I love Grimers. Okay. That's what I get for being greedy, I guess. Makes sense. Uh, run. Of course I couldn't. Alright, Toblerone. It's your chance to shine. We can reflect here. We could eat up hits. And hopefully we can outlast this Meowth who is... Which we have Tackle and Peck for. Alright, reflect. Honestly, I have no idea how strong any of these moves are. None of them are Stab. Wait, does it... Reflect is based around my team. So yeah, it, it doesn't affect through contrary. Oh my god. Um, tackle is base 40. Peck, base 35. Constrict, base 10. The target... This may also lower your... T so wait, tackle. There's no... Is Constrict like the one that keeps doing damage after turns? Is that how it works? Yo, just keep... Boosting my attack, please. This is why I wanted contrary. I love this. This is so convenient. Bite. That's neutral. And we have the reflect up. Mm. So yeah, like I said, uh, things that'll boost me get lowered now. But since reflect boosts my team, not Inke directly, I think it still works. Can you, can you go back to growling? That was so nice. That was really nice of you to growl me. But now you're not doing it anymore. I don't appreciate it. I need to go back to the Pokemon Center now. We did absolutely nothing this episode. So far. Grubina grew level 8. Now I need to go back. Because I'm giving up on Zoro apparently. One more. We'll do one more. What are you eating? Stop eating the blanket, you freak. No. 
No. Oh, he has so many toys. You freak. Shelby got, uh, well, Shelby gave me her old Hearthstone blanket. And Link loves it. Link thinks it's really comfy. But Link will eat it because it's got, like, this hard spot on it. And he loves eating, like, really hard things that he's not supposed to. I'm watching you. Yeah, I was watching you through the mirror because you were stalking me, you creep. You're a creep. He's a freak. <laughs> he really is. I, I, I really want Sorrel, but I don't want to take the time to do it. I'll pass on him for now. Later on, we do have a dark type. We have a dark type. Yeah, we don't need it. We got Inke. Sorrel is such a cool Pokemon, though. There's a bunch of cool Pokemon that we've been able to capture so far, or at least find. It seems like each route has at least one new cool Pokemon, which makes me happy. Really happy. It gives you more unique teams, and I really like the uniqueness of teams. Like, I don't want to use, like, a... Like, that's why I say, like, I hope other Poke YouTubers aren't using this, because it, like, I, I don't want to have a team that, like, other PokeTubers have. I want to have my own unique team. I remember you have an Alolan Grimer, so I'm saving you for last. 100% because I want to get my team stronger. I'm going back in here not to capture Pokemon Unless I do, I do find them, but I'm still Not I'm gonna find him now that I said I don't want him anymore Say hello to Zoroa now All right Oh, look at Rowlet. He just looked back at me. Not you. I wasn't talking to you, you weirdo. Oh my god. I'm knocking him out. I'm sorry. I do love Zoroa, but Inke is on my team. I prefer using Inke. I do like them both, but Inke is so unique. I haven't, like, done a Let's Play with Inke. I feel like you get Zoroa as, like, a special event Pokemon, like, every Pokemon game for the past two or three generations. Yeah, okay, I've made my decision. Are you trying to come up here? What are you- come here then. Come here, you can come up here for a second. He was trying to jump up here and he was failing. Hi, buddy. No, 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 stop. Good boy. Hey, look, over there. Liam, <laughs> Liam's trying to play a game. You're ruining his game. Hey, you could stay right there if you want to. You're not disrupting me or anything. I know, I know. He's like, you're not lying down anymore. Go back to sleep, Liam. I want to bother you while you sleep. Um, I am- thank you, buddy. I'm gonna get rid of Tackle for Astonish. So at least I have some variety to my attacks, and, like, I can hit things for weakness. I don't think there's gonna be something that resists all three, uh, Flying, Grass, and Ghost. Like, Tackle doesn't provide me any stab, su stab support or, uh, weakness, so that I don't think I'll ever really use it. But let's take on this, dude. Uh, do I want to start off with Inke? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Robin Hood's a level 11, so yeah, we need to get Inke on course now. Huh! I'll show you my Grimer's best move. It's Poison Gas. Oh, god dang it. And it's got Poison Touch, too. This is gonna be so annoying. Maybe it's got Power of Alchemy. What was the other... There's another, uh... Ability that Grimer gets, or at least a little muck does. I don't remember what it is. Um, that's at least cool. I remember he gets like three cool Actually like usable. I'm looking at it right now um, Abilities that's like oh you could use any of these in competitive ones whichever ones your favorite you can use Poison touch gluttony. That was it gluttony is really good. Maybe it's maybe it's a little muck that has power of alchemy. I, I Remember that specifically that is a move. I'm not an idiot. I know for sure. I Feel like it's just smart to set up a reflect Although we're about to get poisoned. Very happy. Hi, buddy. What are you whining about? Stop it. Um. Yeah, we tackle. Because that's all I really can do here. Luckily, Grimer's not going to be doing much damage to me. Poison will be doing more damage to me, won't it be? Now they're doing the same. Alright, Toblerone. You didn't do that good. You need to get some stab moves. Hold on. Now I need to look up when Inke will actually get a good move. Any sort of stab move that does decent damage would be great. Um, he'll learn Psy Wave at level 13. Ew. 
Psybeam at level 21, that'll be like the first actual like decent move. Follow play. Follow play is a good move at level 8. Huh. Oh. You are poison dark. So we peck. Wow. Well, this is stab 2. Okay, that did more than I expected to. Can't you miss? Like, poison gas is like 55% accuracy. You hit 2. You're 2 for 2. You're not supposed to be doing that. You're supposed to be 1 for 2. Luckily, is this... Okay, yeah, this is his only one. That makes me very happy. Um, Psycho Cut. Superpower he learns at 48. Oh. Man, I was really hoping he'd learn it early. I wonder if there's a TM or something for super... Superpower. I don't think there is, but that'd be really nice. Youngster Joey! No, the Grimer I found in the tall grass near the school was defeated! Like, you could just say right next to you, because we're literally right next to you. To the grass. I love how we, like, bend over. Grass type Pokemon are immune to powder moves like poison powder. They are? Oh, they are. I don't think that's new. I think that's old. I didn't really quite concept what he was saying. Are they all? I seriously thought like only like sleep powder was. I didn't know like poison powder was because that doesn't seem to make sense to me. I think. I don't know. Oh my god, this is great. I love being just absolutely destroyed by a Grimer and making me use all my potions because I don't want to take the time to go back to the Pokemon Center. <laughs> that takes effort. And ladies and gentlemen, we're not about effort here. We're against the amount of effort I have to use. Uh, like I said, I'm saving you for last. I believe there is one more in the school. And knowing this game, it's not going to be any different uh, locations. Not you. Although you will be my future wife. Look at your Pokemon. I kick it. Yeah, she gave me a quick claw. It's a sign. It's a sign that we're going to get married. <laughs> the Pokemon battle's speed goes up with a quick claw. It's actually a really good item for early game because I have no other items to use. So, where is that? I know, buddy. Oh, Jesus! You're not supposed to. <laughs> that was not a sign for you to jump up here, you freak. Say hello to Link again. No, no, stop. I know. And he's holding the quick claw now. I, I love how he, like, Liam, hi. I wanted to make an appearance here. No, don't lick the game! <laughs> You're so weird. <laughs> Don't look at me like that, too. Oh, you sticking me out? Why do you always love to park it in front of the stairs? Wait, wasn't that the girl? Wait, did things change? You're, you're parking it in front of the girl, the, the stairs, too. Whoa, wait, is there a new spot? Is she, is she in here? There's four. Is it you? Okay, it's not you. Don't, don't, don't talk to me. Is it you? Huh? Look at my Metapod, it's got an orange berry. Okay, well I think I found the fourth one. You gotta go down, tubby boy! Down you go! He's down now. How do preschooler? I love how we battle preschoolers, it makes me happy that we get to beat up on them. Oh yeah, well this Metapod has an orange berry now. So that's at least good news for me. Because this battle will take a tiny bit longer. Because Metapod is bulky! But Peck is super effective, it's not Stab. I wish I had pluck. Um, yeah, we just keep packing over and over again. Oh, whoa, it's got something other than Harden? Awesome! I was seriously thinking, like, oh my god, we're gonna have to sit here and do this for so long. I'd rather you tackle away my, my Inke over and over again. That was not 10 HP. That was, that's bogus! That was like 40! Oh, critical hit. Not a critical hit. Okay. Can't you, like, string shot me or something and boost my speed? Quick Claw. Okay, maybe you don't have to boost my speed, but it would just still be nice. Why did... Th I got a high roll or something on the last one? That last one did so much more. Oh, well, I did Harden afterwards, too, I think. Or does Metapod outspeed me? It does. What? How does a Metapod outspeed an Inke? Like, I literally, like, swim through the air. I never really paid attention to how fast Inke is. It is really slow. Okay, we figured it out. I, I probably could have told you that just by judging that I got outspeed by a uh, same level me uh, Metapod. 
But that's good XP for Toblerone and Grabina and uh, Robin Hood. Wow. Nothing went up there. Foul play. This is a really good move to have early in the game. And it's stab. We're getting rid of Constrict. Stab, foul play. Foul play works by you use your opponent's uh, attack stat, which sometimes would be bad, but for the most part, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. That could be so amazing. I have a berry. Yay! Yeah! I'll give you some more berries too. Here, you take these orb berries. You, you use these wisely. If you don't use them wisely, I'll cut your face off. Alright, goodbye! Alright, let's go take on the final one, and that'll be it for today's episode. Um, I do want to heal. Even though it didn't do too much damage to me. I do want to use Toblerone in this battle because I am afraid of this uh, Grimer. Because I'm pretty sure it's a high level. And I don't want to be taking on a high level Grimer because I'm not... I mean, yeah, no. Grimer doesn't have any weaknesses, does it? Ground. It has ground weakness, that's it. Oh, does even Ekans? I just saw Ekans. But I remember Grimer has like one weakness and it's amazing. The typing's so good because it's got the same typing, typing as Drapion. It works so well. Ekans. Okay, that's not nearly as bad. I still wish I had a Psychic type move. I wish I had Psy Wave at this point. Even though it's a terrible move. Level 8, and it's got Intimidate. I love Inke more and more each time I use them. Foul play, Inke! Would this do more? Because now I got the attack boost. Maybe I should be tackling. Let's see how much this does. I'm perfectly fine with that. And we avoided the attack. Nice! Foul play again, Inke! Yeah, Inke! <laughs> I love my little Toblerone. <laughs> my... I, I don't remember. There was an old Matt TV skit. My little croissant. That's what he said. An old Matt TV skit. Um, I don't remember any of their names. But he's like, can I get your number? Can I get your number? Can I get your... Just look up, can I get your number on YouTube? It's really funny. I love Mad TV. I'm super sad that it's gone. That was that was better than, like, SNL or anything like that. Intimidate is, is an ability that lowers your, your opponent's attack. But apparently it doesn't for you because you have... You're cheating. Take this technical machine. Please let it be intimidated as an ability. Nope, it's work up. How awesome would that be if you could get, like, ability capsules? Uh, I think you can. Can you? Or is that just, like, a fan-made thing? Um, where you could change abilities. But it's like, here. Take this ability, TM. It's intimidate. Teach it to whoever you want. Oh, that's a school bell. Attention all students, would H-Pop please come to the office on the second floor? There's no dumb girl and a Meowth blocking the way that doesn't realize that she could very easily get out of the way so you could go up now. But anyways guys, I hope you did enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like, get out of here. <gasps>